Looking back, rarely has one piece of inflation data impacted market activity and the Federal Reserve with the force that the U.S. consumer price data did after its release on Friday, June 10. The headline year-over-year inflation number rose to 8.6%, but the number that surprised was the month-over-month comparison, which showed inflation had jumped a full 1% in May from April. The May report gave traction to the narrative that the Fed would have to raise rates faster and higher than previously anticipated. Equity markets declined, associated with the 10-year Treasury note yield moving sharply higher, prices lower, and with a reading from the federal funds futures market that raised its expectations that the Fed at its upcoming June 15 meeting would raise rates 75 basis points instead of 50 basis points or a half percent. Despite the fact that the Fed had not made such a large upward adjustment in rates since 1994, the Fed did raise rates 75 basis points and further signaled an equally large rate hike might come at its end of July meeting.